Hi, I'm Marty Miller, Master Instructor for the National Academy of Sports Medicine. Today I'm going to go over an exercise I use a lot as I'm teaching jump mechanics and also jump progressions with any of my clients. I'll use this technique a lot in my certified personal trainer realm when I'm working with clients, but also towards the final stages of the corrective exercise work that I'll do with people, making sure that they can handle an eccentric load before I move them on to more advanced things. And also I'll use it sometimes as a warm up in the performance enhancement area when I'm working with high level athletes or people that are ready to jump. This is a very important technique to learn because in today's fitness industry, there's a lot of explosive and aggressive exercise where people are jumping and leaving the ground. And we need to make sure that our clients can handle that load when they hit the ground and that they know how to land properly, safely, and that their body's ready to absorb that force. So first thing, I just make sure the client is standing with their feet hip width apart. Obviously, as a personal trainer and fitness professional, I'm going to look at all their five kinetic chain checkpoints. So the first thing I have them do is come up onto their tiptoes, that triple extension, and I have them lower themselves down at a pace that they feel comfortable with and a depth they feel comfortable with. Hold three to five seconds and repeat. So they come up into triple extension, drop down, check their kinetic chain checkpoints, three to five seconds, and repeat. I have them perform that usually between 10 to 12 times. And as they progress, I'll let them increase the level and the speed that they drop with, but I'm always gonna have that hold for the three to five seconds because I just wanna make sure that they have the ability to absorb that force properly.